All right, what a day it was. You know, I love days like this when there's so much volatility, so much in play, earnings winners, pump and dumps, frauds. We'll get to all of it. First, I want to give a big shout out to my second millionaire student, Tim Grittani, who's gotten a lot of press on Fox and CNN. He made over $50,000 today alone, uh, mainly on this stock, HEMP. Uh, my first millionaire student, Michael Good, also made nearly ten thousand dollars. I made nearly ten thousand. Um, you know, it, the pattern is straight out of my DVDs. It, it's straight out of so many video lessons. It's straight out of. Let me show you this blog post. This was my tribute to a stock market legend. You can Google it. Just type in, you know, Sykes tribute to stock market legend, and you'll find this. Uh, Marty Zweig. He was a, a great uh, stock picker and teacher. And so I, I was showing some patterns and, you know, I, I have some live videos and the exact same kind of, you know, run up and then crash all in one morning that HEMP displayed today. And if you watch these, you can see my, my live trades. It's also the exact same pattern as this. This was Tim Grittani when he made $200,000 plus in one day uh, back in 2013. And I know that a lot of you guys are like, wow, $200,000 in one day, it seems so unbelievable. Well, it's actually very believable. Um, I've done it a few times. Tim Grittani has done it. Um, I don't know if Michael Good has passed $200,000 in one day. I know he's made $100,000. And we all started with just a few thousand dollars. Uh, you know, you're not going to make $200,000 in one day from the start. Like, you know, you, you start learning trading. Three months later, you're like, I want to make two hundred grand in a day. No, it takes time to grow your account and to learn the patterns. But one, two, or three years from when you start learning these patterns, it is possible. You know, Tim Grittani, this month, February 2014, is celebrating his three-year anniversary with me as a student. Um, that sounded kind of weird, but he's just a student, and, you know, he found me online, um, and he started with $1,500 of his own money. Now he's making $200,000 in one day. Today he made $50,000. And let me just show you this. So I, I highly encourage you to Google this blog post, how to make $200,000 in one day. Just type it in in Google and you, you can read it. It's 3,000 words. Uh, this was his profit chart back then. He was up 661,000. Now he's taken 1,500 and turned it into 1.25 million in three years. This was him in the Maldives. I uh, posted some videos. He posted some charts. And you can see that, you know, he was, he was making like some profits here and there, little ones. But then he went bigger. And it was all because he had confidence in this chart pattern. Here's LTUM. This is out of one of my DVDs. You can see this is an intraday chart, all green, all red, crash, bounce, and then a secondary crash. Uh, here's Fannie Mae. Another time, you know, these are different companies, different sectors, but it's the exact same chart pattern, more or less. Uh, you know, you have greens, you have a big red crash and big greens, huge volatility. I mean, we're talking 50, 100 million shares. Uh, FMCC does the same. Here's the Fannie Mae chart where Tim Grittani made 200,000 plus in one day. You know, you had the greens from 110 up to 140. The crash inside, you know, the, we're, we're talking 10 a.m. to 11 a.m. So 10 a.m. it's at 140, 11 a.m. it's at 60 cents. So a 50% plus crash in one hour. That is the beauty of penny stocks. A lot of people rip on penny stocks, but you don't have 50% drops, you know, in big companies. And I know that there's a lot of short sellers out in the world and they're like, whatever XXX company is a scam and they think that it might drop 50% over the course of a month or a year or a decade when people realize it. This is in an hour. This is how volatile penny stocks are. And let's say you don't like short selling. Look at the bounce. From 11 a.m. to 12 p.m., it bounces from 60 cents up to a dollar. So nearly 70% gains in an hour. You don't have to wait, you know, a year uh, uh, two years, you know, if you make 70% on a stock in a year, you're pretty happy. How about in an hour? This is why I, I can't understand people who rip on penny stocks. They just don't see this volatility. And these are stocks that are trading hundreds of millions of shares a day. Um, so this is a whole blog post. Um, and you can see more of his trades. You know, Tim Grittani is basically shorting these big, you know, red drops and buying the bounce. Um, you know, he was short, I think he was short at 30 or 31 this morning. I know Michael Good short at like 0.318, um, and I was short at 0.28. And it dropped all the way to 18 cents. So you have the same kind of nearly a 50% drop by 10 a.m. in a half hour. And you can see every single tick is down. It's not like this is tough. 
It's just get short and then have patience. And I didn't have enough patience. I covered my shares at like 23 cents. I didn't even get a full position size because I was having some website issues. I'm trying to give alerts. I'm trying to do too much. I'm overstressed. But you don't have to necessarily be that way. You can just focus on your trading. Probably the better alert that I gave uh, was right here at 18 cents. It was actually at like 17.6. And I was like, you know what? Put in a limit to buy, limit of 18 cents. You might make 10 or 20% in an hour or two. And it jumped from 18 cents all the way up to 25 cents. So, you know, I'm not a, a, a great at math, but this is a 40% gain inside of, what is this? 10.05 to 10.45. So in 40 minutes, you make 40%. Uh, that's incredible. And then it kind of peters out. So great day. Congrats to all of you guys. Also, I want to give a shout out to Mark Crook. He gave a great short alert to his uh, newsletter subscribers. He's one of my trading challenge students, but he also teaches. He quit his job as an accountant working in a cubicle. Now he lives in Miami living the life. He's up, uh, I think, a quarter of a million dollars the past few years. Um, so this was, this was a good, uh, good trade. I also wanted to go over um, glue, which I'm actually long overnight. Um, this is an earnings winner. This is the first up day here at 494, uh, 496 actually after hours. I'm long at 493, 494. I'm up a few cents a share. You know, I'm running around doing way too much stuff, teaching too many people thanks to CNN and Fox. So I'm a little out of it with trading uh, right now. But this is an earnings winner. And I think this is going to continue to go up um, for I, I don't know how long. You know, I just want to make 50 cents a share. But... They reported great mobile gaming revenue growth today, uh, just like MET, which I bought here in the low uh, 205, 210 region, and I sold it here in the 239s, 238s. Uh, you know, mobile ad revenue and, and mobile social gaming, that's going to be a, a big sector. Um, so congrats to those of you who held me. You know, I bought this short term and long term. There was no way to lose money on that. Um, also, I want to give a shout out. To GSAT, I, I put a buy alert here on the breakout uh, at two. It went all the way up to 240. I sold a little too early, um, but perfect technical breakout. They have an upcoming uh, product called SatFi, which turns your your wireless cell phone or device into a satellite phone, uh, which is I think going to be an, an amazing product. We still have to get approval for it, but just the the hope of it created this technical breakout, and that was a great 10% uh, winner. Uh, for me uh, in my short-term and long-term accounts. But I, it's not just about, you know, shorting perfect patterns um, or buying, you know, breakouts or earnings winners. I also used to expose a lot. And I had this whole video. I, I did this video this morning. For whatever reason, it, it didn't upload. So the website is actually down, which, which is sad. Um, you know, somebody reported a, a, a web forgery. Um, but this is, it's, it's interesting. So here it is, uh, the, uh, the URL and it's for a stock. The ticker is S I N G sing sing. Uh, and the company is called single point and this web forgery, they, they created a website with single point with two L's. So if you actually take off the, the L, you know, you get to the, the actual real website, which is mobilize your business with single point and it's, you know, mobile credit card checkout. So I was going to, I did do a video, but I was going to show you uh, what their, their fake press release, whoever created that website is going to jail, um, looks like. Because it was, it was a, a ridiculous fraud. Um, somebody reposted it on, uh, on Investors Hub. This, is, uh, this was just registered today. Uh, it noticed the misspelling of single point. And a lot of people in my chat room were buying this. They were like, Oh my God, this is, this is an amazing piece of news. And this is what the news said, uh, it's, which is now, you know, the, the website doesn't work. But they announced a $4.25 million supply contract with PayPal. And this was a total, total lie. Here it says market wired. So that's kind of a, a clue. It's, it's, it should be called market wire, not market wired. Um, but to, to say this, you know, to link eBay and PayPal, um, and they're saying PayPal has elected to license these mobile technologies. Um, you know, th this is this is totally illegal. Uh, and what made me understand it was okay. So you get some 
the the quote from the single brain single single point uh, CEO. I don't even know if he said it. They're probably going to come out and deny it. But then there's a quote from the David Marcus, president of PayPal, and the president of PayPal is saying, with the power single point is able to exercise in Washington, as well as being one of the first companies that is established in the financial cannabis, we are confident that this will be a lasting partnership that will truly go on to make history. Uh, you know, that's a ridiculous statement from the president of PayPal, with the power single point is able to exercise in Washington. Let me just show you what single point is, first of all, S-I-N-G, the, the real company has gone from a penny to seven cents because all the weed stocks are hot right now. They have no power in Washington, okay? They have no power whatsoever. Um, they have no power to even control fraud. I don't know who put out the press release, um, and if you saw the initial version, you would see that it wasn't even a press release. It was actually a fake SEC filing, which somehow I think is even worse. Um, you know, total frauds, just rampant fraud. And you don't get that very often, um, but it's a hot market. You know, weed stocks, it's it's all brand new. Um, so it's kind of like the Wild West, and you have to really be careful. Um, single point, you know, maybe they're they're a good company, but the press release with, with PayPal, uh, total, total lie, total, total fraud, and the person who created it should be ashamed. Um, and then what, what's worse is that they actually used another thing. Um, they put it on CNN, I report. Um, oh, this is still up. <laughs> this is funny. So CNN, I report, you can kind of like put in your, your own articles. You see it says not vetted by CNN. And then it's like, you know, buy pot with PayPal. And 17 people have already shared it. You know, 560 people have, have viewed it. And I'm actually quoted in this um, article. They're saying, you know, uh, buying breakout stocks. Uh, I, I don't know what's going on here. Um, but this is, this is a total lie. And, you know, they're saying, well, according to the recent press release by the first ever marijuana payment processing company, it seems as if PayPal will be playing in the pot sector Super Bowl. So this CNN article is quoting a fraudulent press release. So this CNN article, whoever wrote it, is in on it too. Um, it, it's unbelievable to me that CNN is still posting this, but let me just show you what a real CNN article looks like because it's kind of interesting. So this is Tim Grittani and I. You see how it's all related, and he took fifteen hundred into one point into one million in three years. Now we need to change this to to one point two or one point three. Um, this is vetted by CNN. Okay, we did many phone calls, many documents back and forth to prove that Tim Grittani did it, and it's been shared fifty one hundred times. Um, you know, we got a thousand Facebook likes, nearly 500 retweets. No one really cares about LinkedIn. Um, but this was, this is a real CNN article. This is on, you know, CNN money, not some I report where you can just, uh, you know, put in whatever article you want. And it specifically says not vetted by CNN at the top. So understand the difference. I know it's a scary world. A lot of you guys are, are new traders. You're new to the stock market. Um, even veteran traders, you know, you need to be careful with penny stocks and especially pot stocks. And, you know, you, you need to be meticulous. So I really like shorting them like I shorted hemp. Um, CANN, I want to give a shout out to this. Uh, I said it was a $270 million company. Just going over everything. Um, I said, why this $270 million company with $455 in sales should drop 40%? This was on CANN, another wannabe pot stock. Um, I began shorting this at 21 uh, and continued in the 19s and 18s. And now at 12, it is exactly a 40% drop from when that article uh, came out. And they also did a financing, which I predicted properly. Um, this stuff is predictable, okay? I, I know that it's the Wild West. I know that everything is crazy right now. But is it a coincidence that, you know, I said this stock could drop 40% instead of 50%? No, because I, I know how these stocks should be valued. I know where support and resistance is. And I nailed that. I nailed hemp. I nailed CANN. I sent out the alert to help my people avoid SING. And we'll see if I'm right, um, you know, about this earnings winner, GLUU. GLUU is climbing after hours right now. It's 4.97, um, so I'm up a few cents a share, but we'll see. So congrats, everybody.
Great market, great profits. The rest of you guys who are new, keep learning and you'll get it eventually. Thank you. My name is Tim Sykes and I teach people to trade stocks. I am a self-made multimillionaire. So this is the ideal trade that I'm gonna talk about. I want you guys to understand every single aspect of this trade.